Thank you. Can you start my time again, please? Uh, to DM McCabe, there was extensive consultation with the community developing the bike plan, right? There was. And bike plan is integral to achieving our climate change goals by 2030, or by building it by 2030. It's absolutely fundamental. If we don't, we will not be able to build a city that is net to zero by 2050. That's correct. Right. Uh, does investing in active modes of transportation, such as bike infrastructure, saves lives? Yes, it does. And does it allow people to have a more affordable household by not having the need to buy a second vehicle or first vehicle or third vehicle? Uh, yes, it does. So it ties into affordability directly. And uh, doesn't it enable Edmontonians to do their part to make our city more sustainable by not relying on sing single occupancy vehicles? Having a full network is absolutely fundamental to that so that people can get around safely in a very efficient way to the places they need to go. Okay. And the buildings that we own do produce emissions. That's correct. And as part of our energy transition plan, we need to take steps to reduce those emissions. That's correct. We want to be a, a net zero uh, corporation by 2040. And, and some of the things that I put together in, in this uh, omnibus motion or multi-part motion, particularly undertaking uh, building retrofits, Help us, help us leverage some of the other resources, but also help create a lot of jobs that Edmontonians need. That's correct. Right. So I don't know what we, why are we spending hours and hours talking about something that's so fundamental? I think that's probably a, a I know question, it's not to, question to you. not to administration. I know, yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, that, those are the questions I have. Thank you, Mayor Sohi. Councillor Tang? Great, thank you. 